Hey guys and welcome back to our channel. Um, today I thought I would show you our weekly top up shop. I haven't done one of these videos for ages and the kids eating habits have changed since the last video I've done. So I'll show you what bits I picked up in the top up shop and I'll go through what um, the kids are eating now and what meals we'll make. I actually done a Tesco <clears throat> I actually done a Tesco online order this time around because sometimes it's just easier to order the bits for it to be delivered to the door and then just to put away and I can do it while the kids are at school so no disruption so I'll show you what I got so I got well it looks like a lot of food but actually this doesn't last very long hence why we have to do top-up shops so i've got milk i've got a six pint of milk because sometimes the four just runs out way too quick and then i got we ran out of dilutable juice so i've got this i used to get in me fruit juice but it was just working out so expensive so i thought if i get the dilutable juice and really water it down i can just put this in her um like her flask or her bottle to have. I just got our normal chopped tomatoes for when I'm doing meals like spag bowl. I usually make my own sauce or when I'm making chicken dishes, it just depends. So I got, I think I bought four tins of tomatoes. It was like four for one pound 30. And I got like macaroni cheeses, spaghetti with sausages, ravioli. These are all Immy's safe foods that she still really enjoys. Um, although she now has the cooked meals um, that I make, sometimes she'll have these. So I just top up on these so they're in the cupboards because they're her safe food and she'll definitely eat those. More tin tomatoes. I ran out of soy sauce, so I had to get some soy sauce uh, for my chicken and stuff. This is also another safe food, like super noodles. Um, Emmy loves the noodles, so she'll have these. Um, and Jaden, he will have these, but he'll make um, like a ramen type meal with it, with like spring onions and Frankfurt sausages. It's actually really nice. So I buy these in bulk so that we ha always have them in the cupboard. Here's a sauce, just in case, a bolognese sauce. I actually opted for the Tesco one. I usually do Dol Mio, but actually they taste the same and like I season my meat and if I'm doing spaghetti bolognese and stuff, I season it as well. So you don't really taste the difference. So I thought, let's just go for the Tesco brand and it's cheaper as well. I think it's like 98p, I'm not sure. Eggs, you can't go wrong. Like you can make so many different meals with eggs. I actually ordered a, I think I ordered an 18 pack of eggs but it seems like there's a shortage with the bigger pack so they've just sent me two six packs instead and then so cereals we've got Weetabix, Sugar Puffs and Cocoa Pop. Some more chopped tomatoes and I had to get these so during the holidays we went out for Maya's birthday for a meal and I tried these, they're so good. They are very sweet, but they're so tasty. So I thought I would grab some, I think it's six in a pack for about 3.29 or 3.49. I don't know how quickly we're going through those, but I'll put some in the fridge and some in the cupboard. So I don't want to go through them too quick. And then just got some crisps because the kids haven't had snacks for a while. Sometimes I find it's easier to get the box. You get more um, value for your money. And then just the tinned meals again. Butter because we ran out. They've sent us two small ones. I ordered a large one. They didn't have them. So they've just sent those small ones. Yogurts. Emmy has these after dinner for a dessert. So these are a must, we have to get those. And then we also get these yogurts. 
the squashums. She has them sometimes, but because Maya's on pat lunch at school, she likes to have these in her pat lunch box, so we have to get these too. And then I picked up some snack attacks. Um, Jaden doesn't really eat these anymore, but I mainly get these again for Maya's pat lunch. So she'll have those in her pat lunch box. And then this is another, I haven't tried this for actually. Emmy used to eat this quite a bit chicken and veg pie when she didn't really explore other foods but because she started to explore new foods and she's doing quite well with her eating we don't use them much but I thought let me buy it to see if she'll have it or not so I just bought that to see if she's still interested and then sweet potato mash she loves the sweet potato mash can't go wrong with that just throw that in the microwave and warm that up for her with um make her um, like a jacket potato but without the skin so i'll warm that up and then add some beans and cheese and she'll eat that and then pizza for maya Amy sometimes has this one but she gets the mini frozen ones i get for her not that, that one's mainly for maya again i thought let me try the tesco ones because they the kids don't well maya doesn't really notice the taste different so she's happy with that one and just some rolls for when i make um cheeseburgers or if they want a sandwich at lunchtime on the weekend. And then hot dog rolls. We've actually changed the hot dog rolls that we use. I've now got brioche hot dog rolls because they last longer and Jaden prefers the taste. He mainly has these with Frank Furter sausages and makes them into a hot dog. So yeah, we changed that because he prefers the taste and they last longer. They are more pricey. I think they're about £2.50 for four. more tins because, you know, can't go wrong with those. And then just mixed veg here. I think it was three for two. There's another one somewhere. Three for two fifty. I think it was three for two fifty. I can't remember. But I'll use these with every, every meal. But I'm planning on making a stir fry. So I've got some noodles and I'll throw a pack of those in with the noodles bulk it out, add some diced chicken, and yeah, that will be a meal for one of the days. Spring onions, just to add to some of my meals. These are good meals. These are good ready meals. We have a sweet chili chicken one, and a chicken katsu one. Um, they're quite pricey, I think between £3.50 and £4.50 each but yeah Jaden likes these Jaden never used to like ready meals so um it works out that he likes those especially on days when the kids have activities after school if I haven't got time to do a proper cooked meal then they'll have a ready meal on certain days so those are good for him just my veg cucumber for when I do salads and then you get these baby cucumbers for Maya again for a packed lunch that we get all the time. Coleslaw, baked beans, I've run out so I had to get a four pack. Um, I think Immy and Maya can tell the difference in the taste so we stick to Heinz. Jaden doesn't eat beans, he doesn't like them. Um, and then again just some cherry tomatoes for my veg and I've got peppers blueberries. Maya requested quite a few fruits this week to pop up. She likes their fruits. So I've got blueberries, apples, grapes, strawberries, pineapple. And actually, I've been making a lot of smoothies to drink out of the fruits as well. So that's um, come in handy just to have a mixture of them. There are the Dunkers, I think with my Tesco club card, I got that. I can't remember, I think it was £3.50 for this. But again, they're for my packed lunch. A ready meal, Amy loves her mac and cheese. So I thought, let me try this ready meal. I haven't tried this one, this brand. So we're going to try again, it's trial and error with this brand to see if she likes it. 
and then ice lollies. We have to have ice lollies in the house because Immy loves them regardless of the weather. I do as well, actually. Both girls do. So they'll um, eat these. I always have to top up on those. Here's the frankfurters that we have. So these is what we use as um, hot dogs to go in the hot dog um, rolls. I think these are... These have gone up in price. Um, I can't remember exactly how much they are, but they have definitely gone up. I think they're about £2.50 now. But we don't just use these for hot dogs. If I'm making like a pasta dish, I will chop these up and make like a pasta frankfurter dish that the kids really love. So, yeah, I use this for different things. Pizza half for their dad that he likes. And then these are the pizzas that Amy likes. These are the ones I get for her. They're really small mini pizzas. And she loves pizza. This was the first thing that she really did start enjoying in terms of frozen foods was pizza so i stick with these but she will um eat any brand of pizza which is really good and then Jaden doesn't eat any brand it's just like chicago town so i've got the mini chicago town ones mega meaty i think they was on offer for one pound fifty they didn't have any cheese ones so um, I've opted to get the cheese pizza subs the kids used to eat these all the time so I don't see why they wouldn't now so hopefully they'll have them I think these were one pound and then I just got my grated cheese for like when we like have jacket potatoes cheese toasties all them things salads salad stuff two different types of salads I've got a mixed salad and a sweet and crunchy salad so I could have that when we're making like a burger cheeseburger or chicken burger or if I'm making like um, a meal, my favourite at the minute is um, salmon um, air fried. It is beautiful in the air fryer with sweet potato mash, coleslaw and a combination of this salad is so good. And then I've got some popcorn chicken. I'm not sure how much they were. And these are just for my own hash browns. My doesn't like chips, so... When we're having a meal like pizza and chips or something, she has to have pizza with hash browns instead. So, got hash browns for her because we'd run out. And then meats, and I don't think I bought many meats because we've still got quite a few in the freezer. Oh, I did buy some diced chicken because I want to make that um, stir fry. So I bought some diced chicken. And I, I'm sure I bought some salmon as well, but... Yeah, I did buy some salmon because they put all the fresh bits in here. Also, they had cheeseburgers or burgers, beef burgers. Yeah, these are gorgeous, these beef burgers. So I've got those beef burgers and... Oh, I forgot I got these meatballs. Because it's such a big pack, I'll probably half the pack. Put half in the fridge and half in the freezer. Because the date on that is the 17th of Jan. And then here's my salmon. This is the salmon. And I'll just wash that. Season it. Marinate it. Put it in the air fryer. It comes out beautiful. So now I have the job of putting this all away. But I'll put some music on. And put it all away. Because the kiddies are not here. They're at school. So that's our top up shop. That will last maybe a week it depends on what we make um and because the kids are back at school and don't need to do lunches except for the packed lunch for Maya it should last a little bit longer I forgot to show you the snacks but it's just like um party rings and oreos that Amy will have she sticks to the same snacks um so yeah I picked up a few packs of those but I hope you've enjoyed this video and please like and subscribe to our channel and turn your notifications on to stay up to date with all our videos. We'll see you in the next video.